<laughs> so suns go above and beyond. So it means shifting our mindsets. Um, it's it's not this place of well we don't have to give do tithe anymore so um a lot of people in this movement aren't really even doing that much giving and again it's between you and the lord but it's like as sons let's step up let's shift our mindset Open that, that repentance mm -hmm. out of poverty greed mammon um also generationally cleaning up from our bloodline where there has been god robbing um other you know areas of greed and mammon to be dealt with and being obedient to what he says what is god saying um and cleansing our resources with the blood of jesus we were more faithful at this in the beginning but you know remembering that whatever you guys give to us you know we're just asking that to be cleansed washed with the blood of jesus and then giving thanks for what we've received joyfully giving where father leads us and looking for opportunities to bless others and that's something <clears throat> I, I got to do here just recently. Mm -hmm. um, I've, I've wanted to do this for decades and I just never have got myself to do it. Um, but finally, I went out and I bought, you know, some just some uh, food items that come single packaged. And uh, bottom line is I just made these little bags so that when I do come across somebody who's homeless, who is, you know, asking for something that I have something to give. It's got a bottle of water in there and the, uh, you know, $5 cash and just to have it to give, just to bless others. And there was a time, and I shared this story before, but there was a time where father told me to get a, I think it was $150 in $5 bills. And every day, every day I was, this is just what father gave to me. I was to find somebody to give five dollars to every day. And the kids That's really hard. liked that. <laughs> <laughs> they, but it was only giving once, you know, one time to one place. So it was a challenge to find a place to give five dollars. I was standing in a bank line, a line at the bank, and Father just said, "Give the lady in front of you five dollars." And I'm like, oh, "That's," you know, I was I was embarrassed to think of the idea of just giving five dollars to the person in front of me, and but I was obedient, and so I. And she nearly cried because I gave her five dollars. We're not used to giving. Yeah, and especially some some yeah. random person giving you five dollars. It just was incredible, really. So I'm not saying go out and do that, but that's just uh, opening the portal. Ask Father what is meant, what He wants you to do to open that portal, and to see where to give. And I know that uh, the sons are giving to things that are kingdom, that are building kingdom. So be asking Father where that might be for you. And if he's not asking you to give, then don't give. That would be disobedient to give to something when he's not telling you to give. Yeah.